Hey everyone, Solo Sticks here. Welcome back to my channel tonight. I am playing my very first episode of Phasmophobia on my channel. I am drinking tonight good old fashioned strawberry kiwi Zevia. Love this stuff. Cheers to episode number one of Phasmophobia. Mmm. Little kick in the pants. Love this stuff. It's so freaking good. Anyway, tonight. I am going to be learning how to play this game because I've never really honestly played it that much. Um, joining me is my good buddy James. I'm going to go ahead and hop into the game here in just a second. Um, I thought it was appropriate to do this for uh, Scarefest. So let's do this. Get in here. Suit up. All right. All right, you there, James? Yep, I'm here. Sweet. Right behind you. So tell me about what scenario are we doing? I think we're gonna hit Tanglewood. Okay. Again, that's what we. Yeah. It's just, it's better to learn at that place because it's so small. It's only got two stories. We got the upstairs and the basement. Right. And we'll just run through the typical things we look for so that we uh, don't die. Perfect. I can't promise you I won't just because I don't know anything, but uh... <laughs> little clip, yeah. little, little clip for you. I'm going to stick this one there just because it's appropriate. All right, it's time to go to school, son. Come on, get your hands up, man. You need an interpreter? It's time to go to school. You're going to lose. <laughs> Oh, uh, we're gonna rock you for it. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that's that's what the ghost just said to me. He said you will lose. So, <laughs> time for uh, James. Off to the van. Time to James. James to uh, t take me to school. That's what it is. Well, let's roll. <sighs> All right. Hey, hey. Uh, are you there? There he is. Yep. Sorry, the audio jumps out. No, you do the loading screen. It's weird. Like, the audio jumps out, but then I I loaded up like instantly, and there was nothing here. I was like, okay. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Guess I'm running this by myself with no equipment. <laughs> so, what do you recommend I take? Flashlight, obviously. Um, I would just stick with. Yeah, got the same flashlight, EMF reader. Um, anything. Okay. Probably glow stick in case you see a door open, see if there's fingerprints. Okay. Controls are definitely just a little bit sensitive or weird. Okay. Yeah, it can be a little tricky. So you, um, you can only have, is it three items in total? Correct. Okay, gotcha. But in VR, you can have like five or something. Well, I shoot, why am I not playing this in VR? <laughs> I could, I mean, technically. Yeah. I would love to play it in VR. You have, do you have an Oculus? I don't. I don't have anything. Damn, VR related. Damn. I don't know what to buy. Uh, I so, I so, so if you had an Oculus, we could play golf. I'm just saying. What? Yeah, it's got mini golf. It's freaking awesome. So, so okay, that's def. I'll, all I wanted on Oculus was Resident Evil Four. It's amazing. But... That's a good game. Ooh. Resident Evil Four is good, but I probably play walkabout mini golf more than I play anything, truthfully. So. Whoa! Oh shoot! I gotta snag one then. Plus, they just came out with the uh, Oculus Quest Three, I think. So. Oh, there you go. I'll have to check that out. Let's see. Um, what are we photo. looking at? What are we looking at? Escape. At Cap the objectives. Oh, okay. Capture a photo of the ghost. Have a member of your team escape the ghost during a hunt. And prevent the ghost from hunting with a crucifix. Yeah. The escape one will probably, since we don't have smudge sticks yet, 
that's probably not going to happen. That's like your one attack against the ghost that you do not have. Oh. So, it basically stuns them for like six seconds so you can get away. But, uh, we don't have those yet. Because I was, I had like $300,000 on my old account, but they redid all the levels. They just did a, a swipe. They just like ended it all. Holy crap. We started. Well, yeah. well, well speaking of starting, <laughs> you know what we do on my channel quite often. Oh, that's right. We're in the safety of the van, so. Oh, yeah. We're, well. we're in the safety of the van. We're going to do some Jelly Belly action. <laughs> and I just rolled a regular. So you want to, you got your oh. Jelly Bellies at the ready. You can, oh, yeah. you can spin for us. Okay, here we go. If it spins right, what is that? <laughs> no. What? Uh, what? I don't know. What in fresh hell did you just it's, spin? It's a pomegranate. Okay, fine. Thing. Fair, fair enough. I don't want to. Might as well be tortured. All right, I got mine. Do you got yours? Unfortunately, I do. All right, on the count of three. One, two, three. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. I can't. I can't. <laughs> hey, guess what, dude? Hmm. Mine was pomegranate. Oh, thank god one of us got it. <laughs> yeah. So, here's 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 a clip. Here's a clip for James. Poor James. Oh. oh that's the worst thing ever. Yes. Oh, so god. poisoning. <laughs> <laughs> I love that clip. Uh, oh. good, good old Christmas story. It was <laughs> soap poisoning. <laughs> love it. I'm gonna up the bad for you because that's that's su sucks for you. Yeah, at least you got a pomegranate. I'm thank, happy for you, man. Thank God. Jeez, that never freaking happens. <laughs> I've never seen you get a pomegranate. Uh, it's it's pretty freaking rare. I'm gonna be honest with you. Mm. All right. Okay, we got lights. We'll grab the key. Start looking for the bone in the ghost room. See nothing. Oh, what was that? I heard something. I got my EMF reader. Oh, perfect. Yeah, it's a good hiding spot in there. In case, uh, oh, oh, I got reading. Okay. We got a That's two a and a half, two and a half, three right there. Okay. Three. All right. Three. So, what's the glow stick actually do? Um, if it touches a door or like you know a closet door or something, there's it'll a, show there's us. a oh, hand, handprint. Handprint right there. Oh, perfect. Yep, there you go. You just answered your own question. Perfect. Look at me. Look at me. Yay. So you can write that off as evidence. We got ultraviolet. So how do we do that? Let um, me just open up your like, menu. And then go into <laughs> evidence. And yeah. Whoa. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> What's up? My, my thing's being weird. Evidence. Ultraviolet. So it, it, it basically, oh, I get it. It, it like narrows it down. Exactly. We need three pieces of evidence. So we got the first one. Cool. That's actually pretty cool. All right. Where are you at? Okay, gotcha. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to switch to EMF. Knock that down, too. Might be a hallway ghost. I don't know. Let's here, here. I, I, think we need, I think we need this clip. Just saying. Hold on a second here. It's got to hate this. It's got to. <laughs> like to torture him. That's right, boys. It's Dr. Venkman. All right, boys. It's Dr. Venkman. Oh, 
No readings. Yeah, I probably won't be. I'm gonna try to find a cursed object and a bone. Oh, right. There's a bone. Okay, what's a bone do? It's like a... I don't know why every level has one, but you just take a picture of it, grab it, doesn't take any inventory slots, and then that's it. it gives you like extra like money when you make it out. That's a good hiding spot there. Let's see, no cursed object in here. It must be in the basement. Basement. You don't have to find it. Basement! Hold on. Yep. Oh. Nobody said anything about basement. <laughs> oh shit. That's a summoning circle, so that is a cursed object. We won't touch it though, we don't have a lighter anyways, but if you light the whole thing, it'll engage a cursed hunt. So, gotta be real ready for that. I got a clip for that too. Leave that be. Keep that bad door shit. Yeah. Uh, Nobody moves! And what the fuck is that thing? Come on, lady. You ruined my day twice already with this bullshit. Put the weapon down, or I will shoot you! Well, as you can see, we're just a little busy here. Now! Grab more stuff. So I suppose I could probably ditch the, the ultraviolet, right? Yep. Bye bye. You can grab the spirit box right there. He <laughs> he said box. You can start asking it questions. I'm gonna look for ghost orbs. Wait, that may have been one. How old are you? Where are you? Are you there? Ghost, talk to me. Yep, we got ghost orbs. Okay, it's getting cold. I see my breath. All right, and uh, you can shut your flashlight off for a second and grab that camcorder. Uh, which is where? Right here? Right here. I can't see. Oh, right there. Oh, right on your feet. Yeah. Pick it up. Pick it up. Drop. <laughs> okay, got it. All right, look through it. Make sure the night vision's on. Okay, how do you look through it? I just uh, it should be like right trigger. Okay. Not seeing it. It just has a little screen that pops up. Yeah, so look through it. Is the night vision on? It is. Okay, well, you see the little. You'll see a little dot swirling around. And that's what a ghost orb looks like. If you can see, it should be over here. Like, just so you know what it looks like. Huh. That's weird. You can see it. Probably look at it from here. Oh where shit! I am. <laughs> Jackass. What? I just dropped it. Oh, it's all good. I, you don't have to. I'll just. I'm just. just so you know what it looks. No, like. you're good. I was just trying to. Uh... There we go. Oh, I'll leave this down here. So Ghost orb. Right in the book, maybe. No, I was just trying to figure out if I could zoom. That's weird. Oh, yeah, it's a ghetto one right now. We don't have the good stuff yet. What the heck? Oh, you're using the laser thing. Yeah, see if it walks through. So, where's the thermometer at? <laughs> Don't answer that question, Ryan. <laughs> oh, we're close. We're real close to it. Dang it, I keep pushing the wrong button. Oh, it's freaking. That sounds. That's a spike. That sounds high. Whoa. Okay. How high is it? It was over a five. Okay, so that's the second piece of evidence. Right. 
So how how do you get freezing temps? How do you actually know when you're when you're being hunted? That's my question. This front door closes and locks. You start to hear it walking and making all kinds of noises. That's when you know you gotta hide. And like the electronics go crazy. Typical ghost shit. Typical. Yep. It just doesn't seem to want to drop to zero. Hmm. Oh yeah, it's cold. Mm -hmm. Just doesn't want to go. It has to go below thirty-two. I'm sure, my sanity's super. Nope. Now it's coming up. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Must be moving. <clears throat> Should have got more Ghostbusters clips. <laughs> Heard to open that door again. I'm gonna see if I can get some dots. That would be ideal. It's really heartless though. Can I get dots? Oh wait, we got ghost orbs. I forgot, it's an Obaki. We can get the hell out. Really? Yeah, we good. Let me just make sure. Sometimes the mimic will mess you up. Spare box. Yeah, I think we're good. So you can go into your book under evidence. Uh -huh. Make sure Obake is circled. Gotcha. Cool. Yeah, these are too tricky, so... Cool. Let's see if that works. Yeah, I was about to hunt this anyway. Sanity's pretty low. Uh. Okay! All right. Hey, look. There's some jobs ready for you. I got money. <laughs> there you go. Sweet. First one, you got the ghost right. There you go, baby. Whew. Not too shabby. No way I could have done that without help. I have no idea what I'm doing. So, cheers to that, man. Oh, no, you're you're doing great, man. Yeah, thanks to James. Thanks to James, who's got a few more hours in this game than I do. <laughs> speaking of speaking of speaking of things, we're gonna we're gonna do a jelly belly right here. <laughs> oh, that is another regular. Okay. I'll let you spin. <laughs> oh God. Just, I can't do strawberry, banana, smoothie, or dead fish because I have no more of those left in this particular box. Alright. That was right in the middle. Okay. It, okay. Peach or barf? Oh, I got plenty of those. Great. <laughs> Alright, here we go. One, two, three, go. Uh -huh. Hey, what do you know? Dude, I got peach. <laughs> oh, no, no. Mm -mm. Huh. Ah. Ah. <laughs> no. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> uh oh. <clears throat> We're watering up. There it is. <laughs> we'll go in one more. I had to put the. Uh, the TikTok, the famous TikTok girl on there going, <laughs> Those are actually really funny. Yeah. And totally, totally fake. It's got to be totally fake. So, yeah, I will tell you what. So, yeah. so I got to put a clip in here, y'all. James can't see or hear any of these, but I can at least kind of see him on my side monitor. So this is honestly kind of how I feel right now. Playing with playing along with James and having him teach me. I kind of, I kind of honestly feel like this right now. Have you ever had a dream that 
that you um you had you yeah. you mm -hmm. you could you do you you want you you could do so you you do you could you oh. you want you want him to do you so much you could do anything. <laughs> uh yeah, that's how I feel right now. Just saying. <laughs> I feel like a total retard. So. Uh, <laughs> Uh, dude, seriously, you're doing great. Like, you use the equipment properly. You know what you're doing. So that's awesome. Except for I don't know how to ready up. <laughs> Where are we oh, going? No, dude, you're good. Where are we going? We'll just go to the next one, Edgefield. Let's see how that goes. Edgefield. Now yeah, here we go. All right, Edgefield. He says we're headed up to Edgefield. Hmm. With barf, with a barf flavor in my mouth still, I, I absolutely cannot stand some of these jelly bellies. So they just, they just stay in your mouth no matter what. Okay, so have a member of your team escape during a hunt. Have a member of your team we'll focus. witness a ghost event and get an average of sanity below 25%. Okay. Yep. So we'll just focus on the ghost event one since, again, we don't have the smudges. It makes it too risky. So I will take glow stick, flashlight, and an EMF to begin with. That just seems to be my norm right now. So. All right. Hey, whatever makes you comfortable. You seem to be like good with all the stuff, so... That's what, she, that's what she said. <laughs> you walked into it, James. I set you up oh, with the jab, and you just walked right into it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Dang it. All right, Edge, Edgefield, she says. <laughs> oh, there's no key. Whatever. It doesn't really matter. Okay, just, if a ghost does hunt, I usually will leave it around this couch. Like, I'll just run around and see what it does. That can sometimes give me an understanding of what it is. But if it's like a revenant, I'm so dead. Because once they see you, they go super fast. Huh. Yeah, but then a Diogen will slow down to a crawl when it gets right up to you, so you can just keep running away from them. So you just never know. See, this is... hiding spot in here, too. This is what it's like to, to, to be around an educated person. No. I'm telling you, that, that clip was perfect. <laughs> There's a bone. On the bone. Snap that picture, and you can go pick it up. Just see if, like, it won't take any image. Oh, where's my burbs? Where's there my burbs go. clip? <laughs> this is Walter. Ah! Please tell me you've seen the burbs. I haven't. You've never seen the burbs. All right. No. Well, that's okay. It's it's kind of corny anyway. Is that? It's it's an eight. Mandatory. Not really. It's my if if you ask my dad, he'd say yeah, but. Okay. It's a it's an old Tom Hanks comedy horror. Oh, okay. Uh, it's got Carrie Fisher in it. What? Yeah. Check the basement. I have no idea where he went. <laughs> what? Where? Where did James go? And in the basement. There he is. You know? <laughs> oh, you can use the radio to talk to me from a distance. Oh, know. okay. <laughs> it's like right button. Yeah, right button. I forgot about that. I don't know, man. Fear of the dark. Hey. 
Oh, it's a monkey. You can like use this to make a wish, but we'll just leave that since we don't have any smudges. Is that <laughs> a monkey's paw? Yeah, I don't know. I don't get it, but you can make a wish. And it. If I know anything about monkey's paw and wishes, it's cursed. Ask the Simpsons. Oh. <laughs> wish, I, okay. wish I had a monkey's paw. <laughs> yeah. I've but. never like heard of the whole thing. Oh, it's a classic, classic episode of The Simpsons. Oh, man. Got no readings. I got my EMF. I'm trying to get some readings. I don't get nothing. It's a chill ghost. I forget, too. We, we have, like, five minutes of time to, like, look around. Before it does anything, oh, so. oh, oh. Five minutes of playtime. <laughs> hey, freak show. You're going nowhere. <laughs> now I get it. bone saw. Bone saws ready. <laughs> yeah. That was the Macho Man, right? Like that. Yeah. You played him. Oh, my Randy Savage. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> yeah. Bruce Campbell was you the like. Bruce Campbell was the ring announcer. Dude. I they set him up to be the perfect Mysterio. <laughs> like, seriously, he's always a different person in every movie. I'm like, that's perfect. He'd be a great Mysterio. Well, he's a freaking... He's like Sam Raimi's best friend, so... So, that would make a great villain, but... Uh, it would have made too much money um, by the man four. He's on... Well, uh, shoot, this is a... This is nothing. I got no readings at all. Oh, temperature drop. Yeah, is... A little bit here. Well, the needle I'm actually sure. moved. <laughs> what? What? Open, open, open. Very chill. Sorry, I don't have to do the equipment. Sorry, what was that? Sorry, my equipment sucks. I haven't played a lot since they did the new big update. <laughs> I was about ready to put a bad joke in there. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I got bad equipment. That comes with age, James. <laughs> they have medicine for that. <laughs> oh, but you're young yet. <laughs> oh, let's see here. Yeah, this thing is just taking its sweet time. Wait. Oh, scared me. <laughs> well. Oh, I got a reading. Oh. Two and a half, three in here. Oh, since the living room goes, maybe. I'm gonna shut off the lights real quick. Let's see if I got any orbs. Actually, I need to shut that up too. Oh crap. I heard that. That was a ghost of that. I got no, no freaking, uh, okay. no action on the, uh, glow stick. Okay. Uh, Where'd you head? I'm grabbing some supplies in the van.
Oh, oh shit! There it is. <gasps> what? I just got locked out. <laughs> I got locked out, dude. <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> oh, no. James. <laughs> Let's just ditch James and run outside. <laughs> All right, I'm going to grab. Oh. You still there, James? I don't know if your mic's on or not. Oh, shoot. Sorry. I muted it. Ah. I forgot when I... You're good. I was like, dude. Not bad. <laughs> Where are you? From behind us. Oh, okay. Spirit box. Spirit box. I have it. Okay. So you can check that off your evidence. Okay. And I don't think we have anything else yet. Evidence. Spirit box. So that takes it way down. What'd you what'd you find? Um, that's that's it for no, now. No freezing so temperatures or anything else? Not yet. I'm gonna go look and see if the temperature's down. It might find it. Oh shoot, James! James? <laughs> yeah, I'm here. The front door open. No. Oh. Okay. Where'd you go? I'm upstairs. Okay, I'm gonna go outside real quick. Uh oh. Oh. ugly little spud, isn't he? I think he can hear you, Ray. Don't move. It won't hurt you. Batman, what happened? Are you okay? He slimed me. He slimed me. That's how I am right now. Dead as a doornail. I think it's cool that you can walk around. Obviously, James can't hear me right now, but it's cool that you can walk around and, like, see stuff. Wonder where James went. Downstairs, maybe?
Too bad I can't scare James. That'd be great. <laughs> I'm gonna try something, y'all. I'm gonna try something. Uh, stay right here. Huh. I think next time I die, I'm gonna have James unmute his microphone. Just so I can hear, still hear him. Oh, there we go. Something happened. Something happened. <laughs> All right. <laughs> no. I had a. I was wondering. Sorry about that, man. Oh, you're good, man. Not my, not your fault at all. That's hilarious. <laughs> so I think, uh, um, if it's just us playing. And not mm -hmm. and not anybody else. If yeah. if I die, which will probably be ninety nine ninety nine percent of the time, if I die, go ahead mm -hmm. and and unmute your Discord. Oh, okay. Just so I can still hear you talking. Um, because when because gotcha. once you turn into a ghost and you're walking around mm -hmm. and stuff, you can't hear any and you can't hear anything. So. Oh god. Okay. Just a thought. It's different now. Wow, they changed it. I can hear you, but it's like my I, can't, I couldn't oh. find I couldn't find you or or anything. It was weird. I didn't see you anywhere. Oh, but you could still hear me, you said? Like really really distant muffly. Okay. So, I was basically okay. just talking to myself. <laughs> Uh, oh yeah, me too. So. <laughs> <laughs> and here I am uh, by myself, uh, uh, talking to myself. <laughs> there gonna be any uh, dinosaurs on this dinosaur uh, tour? <laughs> <laughs> Good old Jeff Goldblum. He was in a movie I just watched too. So. Oh yeah. Yeah, it was another uh, morning morning glory or morning. Remember, it was, a, it was an old Harrison Ford, Harrison Ford movie, like early mid two thousands, late two like teens. Check kind of a chick flick. Wife. Oh, wife, okay. Wife and I watched last night. It was good stuff. Ooh, nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Where are we headed now? Okay. I say we hit Ridgeview. Okay. I say we hit a Jelly Belly. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Oh, shoot. That's a reroll. How about four hots? Oh, shoot. Okay. And I'll let you roll. I'm letting you roll tonight. You're in charge, man. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Uh, habanero. I can do that. Four of them. One. Cool. Two. Three. And four. I got some new clips for this. Ooh, nice. All right, here we go. One, two, three, go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's not so bad. Uh -huh. yeah. It's more tingly than hot. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Up our uh, if you fellas excuse me, I gotta use the phone, man. Enjoy your Which meal, now guys. puts me up to 188. Oh, this helps. Oh, that was good. 188 hot jelly beans, baby. There you go. Mm. Shoot. I'm probably gonna get the hiccups. Huh. They usually do. <laughs> Yep, a little bit. There it goes. <clears throat> <laughs> Ready up. 
Had to get that. Had to get that uh, out of the way. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. That was good. That was good. Kind of uh, helped get the old bandage out of my mouth. Anything to get the old bandage out of your mouth. That's so nasty. We played the Cory last year. I played it twice. Once on my scare fest, I think. No, what? No, it wasn't really scare fest. Once in the summer, and then I played it with a guest. And uh, yeah, we find we that. we finally call we 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 came to call the uh, my buddy Dan and I called the uh, old bandage Laura's Laura's bandage. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. It's a character in the in that game called Laura. Laura's bandage. Little chocolate action going on tonight. Mm, mm, mm. All right, let's do it. Okie doke. Mm. Mr. Goodbar, man. Mm. This is another one. My brother. I got a story about that. My brother had this horrible thing about stealing my stuff. I had a. Ah, I'm sorry, I was telling everybody a story. I I got a giant crackle bar for Christmas one year, and my brother ate it. <laughs> That's what I'm having. That's what I got. I'm crackle bar right now. What a betrayal! It's all right. I got an ice cream story to tell you another time. <laughs> he baby. Well, I'll just tell you a short version. Baby sat me one time. I was probably like eight. I don't know, like eight, nine, ten years old. And he was watching me. Mom, my mom was some training session uh, for her work. And she brought this cookies and cream ice cream. And all week, every week, I would all, during the week I'd come home from school and get go to get some ice cream. And he'd be like, "You finished your homework?" And I'd be like, "No." And he'd be like, "You gotta have ice. You gotta finish your homework before you have ice cream." So I hated homework and I never finished it. So um, the next day, same thing happened. Next day, same Friday came around. Finally, Friday came around and mm -hmm. I went to get ice cream and he's like, did you do your homework? I was like, it's Friday. I don't care. He's like, I went to look in the freezer. No ice cream. And he's like, something bad happened. And I looked in the garbage, empty container of ice cream. He ate the whole half gallon during the week. Never oh got any. My gosh. <laughs> so, so it's an ongoing joke. I'm actually famous. He tells that story in his band class every year in his eighth grade band's class. But uh, for for quite a while, he he would come visit almost every year, and he he came up and one year bought me a half gallon of of uh, cookies and cream ice cream. He's doing that every every year. He came to visit to make up for it. I'm like, oh come on. <laughs> Now you're gonna now you're gonna have to buy me really cool. Yeah, it's pretty funny. He I said now you need to buy me king size crackle bars for that crackle bar you stole in mine. <laughs> so this goes to Dave right here, this little crackle bar I'm gonna eat. Alright. Go. I got my equipment. Alright. Let's roll. We don't have a crucifix. Oh, I didn't arm one. That's my bad. So that is one item or one part of the uh, objectives we will not achieve. Shoot. That's all right. That's a good hiding spot here. It's uh, it a little crazy. All right, I am going to. I'm gonna pop open the pop on the uh, EMF reader just because that's one of the objectives anyway. So just remember. Remember, if I die, to turn on your Discord mic.
You find something? Your mic's really quiet for some reason. I'm not sure why. Oh, sorry. It might be how I'm facing you or something. Ah. Now you're loud. Yeah, the proximity chat's kind of wonky sometimes. All right, so nothing down here. I will just tell you, James, you need to buy a pair of these headphones that I'm wearing. What is it? These headphones I'm wearing from when I game. Yeah. You need you need to get a pair of these. They're they're insane. Ooh, what are they? They are I or sorry, uh Skull Candy Crusher mm -hmm. Crusher Wireless. They're about a hundred and thirty dollars, I think. Oh they bad. But they, they charge forever and the the thing that's crazy is they have a insane base boost. So games that are oh. bassy or like gun, you know, explosions, gunshots and stuff, it's freaking loud. Oh. I said bone. Yeah. It's about the. Oh, uh, that's, solo. that's about the uh, the the uh, extent of my guitar skills right there. There we go. What'd you say, James? I was just, I was just asking the ghost some questions. Ah. Uh, got no zero. Response. Zero. Shower was on. Oh, where? The, up upstairs, up here? But yeah, right down the hallway. Oh, hold on a second. I don't see any handprints or anything in here with the with the ultraviolet. So I'll, I'll switch over to my EMF again. Okay. Oh, there you go. Uh, so got a three. Got, Perfect. Got Check a, your, um, your UV if you can. Uh, nothing. And on the other side. Nothing. Okay. So no UV. But what one of my one of my uh, one of the objectives was to get an EMF reading, right? Yep. Oh, is that you oh, that shut the door? Me. Okay. Yeah. Let's see if it's a hallway ghost. Uh, I don't know. I'll just set stuff up here. Let's see here. Uh, okay, so it has to be, so it has to be EMF level five to, to actually check it off on your on your evidence. Yeah, gotcha. Correct. Interesting. Spot two. Yeah. I don't know what the cursed object is. So. so how do you how do you go about finding cursed objects? Like, how do you know what's what? Besides, oh, you just know, like, sometimes it's a Ouija board. Oh, so something obvious. A, gotcha. A yeah. They're just, they're hidden throughout each level. I don't know. I 
Like, you'll eventually know where they're at in every level, but I haven't memorized them yet. So I've got there. Start grabbing more stuff. Man, my guy needs to hit the gym. Yeah, <laughs> the cardio is so bad in this game. He's freaking panting and I didn't even do anything. Uh-huh. I thought Outlast was bad. <laughs> Different level. <laughs> oh, grab. There we go. Seriously, run, dude. <laughs> Still pretty warm up here. Okay. Okay, what is the... I just turned it off. Tempers is dropping a little bit. Okay. Not much. It's still above 50, not, it's still above 60 degrees. Alright. Checking out the basement. No reading is down there. Okay. This is a really chill ghost. Tell you, piss him off. Oh, oh, oh. two, oh. two and a half. What? Oh. oh, right here? Yeah. Like right as you went to go up the stairs. A steady one. Oh, it wrote in the book. We got ghost writing. Okay. You can write that as evidence. Okay, that narrows it down. It's up here. Maybe freezing temps, but I don't know. Let's find out. Well, 68 right here. dropping okay. 
Okay, well. Yeah, it's pretty much a solid, solid one on the EMF. I should stand there. I'm gonna look around for just a second. So that's a, here's a question for you. Yeah. How do you purchase more equipment? How do you get more equipment? Oh, it's at the um, our loadout screen when we red up. You right. Just move to the right side. And then. So do you, you is the current stuff. is the currency what you get when you earn experience? Mm-hmm. Yep. Figured so. I just had to ask. Might be kind of a dumb question. Oh, yeah. Whoa, shit, Spike! No, it's not just a... Okay, it's having a little event. It's going crazy. Oh shit! Hey, guess what? It's all good. Mm. And that really hurt, Johnny, and it's still <laughs> hurting. As the uh, as the as the clip as the clip just said that I played, <laughs> Char Charlie bit me. <laughs> oh my god! Four percent. Ha, ah, there we go. Sorry about that. Oh, no worries, man. Uh, I forgot Sorry to- you died. I- I- it's a good dude. Charlie bit me. <laughs> Charlie bit me. And that really hurt, Charlie. And it's still hurting. Uh, so it's crazy, I can't see anything. Where are you at? <laughs> I'm in the van. Oh, you're outside. Yeah, I'm going through evidence real quick. Um, let's see. I don't know what the heck that was. <laughs> That's funny. I can actually hear double of you now. It's funny. Oh. That's fine. <laughs> you can leave your Discord on. That's fine. So, if I'm dead, can I see the ghost? Yeah. Really? You can throw stuff. I can throw stuff? Mm -hmm. What? You could go grab a shoe and bring it to the van and throw it at me if you wanted to. Okay, this is this is just this is this is whole nother level here. Hold on a minute. Oh yeah. Prepare to be punked. I just have to figure out how the heck where I went. <laughs> well, here we are. Uh 
<laughs> Are you thirsty? I don't know what the heck it was. So I can see the ghost though? I mean, yeah, if it were to start hunting me again, but I mean, it changes appearances from different types. Like, you just never know. Oh, shoot, I just realized I could. Oh, never mind. I thought I could walk through walls, and I guess not. You should be able to, but. Nah. Well. I don't know. Definitely not a demon. Which means it probably is. <laughs> I'll just say it's shade because it was not aggressive, but I don't know. It's cool because I, now that we can still communicate, I'll I'll still be able to learn from you. So. Oh yeah. If I shoot, I'm sorry. If I had smudge sticks and a lighter, I could really show you how to play. Because you get to be much more aggressive. Gotcha. That's when the game gets a lot better. Once I learned how to smudge, it like made me love this game. Explain ex actually, explain to me what that does. What what's up what's it, up with that? You have like four smudge sticks once you unlock them. And once the ghost starts hunting you, it can like you can go after the ghost oh. and smudge it in the face and it goes on all it goes off in a different direction and you can go hide and get away from it because it actually gives you some sort of an attack which is great um or what i like to do the most is to have it in my hand and then let the ghost chase me and then i'll loop it around a couch or a countertop and see what it's doing huh. and then once it gets too close i'll just smudge it and then run and find a hiding spot and be good to go that's pretty cool yeah it's just makes the game way more fun <sighs> Well, since you're take a lot more chances. Since you're ghost hunting and I'm not, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a jelly belly right now. Oh, I'm about to end it. So. Oh, I'm just gonna say shade, probably not. But I'm just gonna close the doors. Bye, James. Have fun. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I get left behind. James says, see you later. <laughs> There's some jobs ready for you. See you on the other side. Yeah, see me on the other side. Uh... You suck, you jackass. Why don't you <laughs> shut the hell up? <laughs> cool. Cool, cool, cool. Well, I, I'm going to go ahead and I, got it. I already did this on my screen, but I'm going to roll. Oh boy. That's a regular. You can you can spin for a regular. Okay. Uh, I was playing uh, Alan Wake uh, earlier, and mm -hmm. I actually got a Tutti Frutti. I never get those. Look, actually, yeah. Oh, that's a rare one. Yeah, it tastes like... Uh, tastes like the old uh, bazooka bubblegum to me. Oh. Nice. Yeah, a lot better than freaking stinky socks, I'll tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what are we yeah. eating? Uh, cappuccino or liver and onions. Oh, gosh. Uh, I, I'm not a big cappuccino fan, so either way, it's going to taste crappy. There we go. Oh, One, two, three, go. Hey, what do you know? Wow. Hmm. I'm guessing that you got liver and onions. Yeah, you're right. Wow. <laughs> I've never had that one. <laughs> hmm. like this food. is not fun anymore. <laughs> <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> you are more than welcome. Jeez. <laughs> That's gnarly. It's not old bandage, but it's gnarly. No, and the thing about that one, dude, I did an episode the other day. Mm -hmm. I want to say it was it was during uh, Alan Wake, one of them. 
and I literally, I legitimately got it stuck in my throat. I started like gagging. <laughs> oh, God. It wasn't because it tasted bad. It's because I was literally choking on it. And I, I, <laughs> I ended up like trying to, I ended up eating something to try to make it go down because not nothing I was doing was making it go down. I was like, ah, <laughs> crap. <laughs> Yeah, not yeah, not a, need something extra bubbly for that. Yeah, not a pleasant senta- sensation. I will tell you that right now. So, uh, all right. Well, we're at an hour and seven minutes. Oh shoot! So, I, I don't know. It is almost nine o'clock. You, you got to work tomorrow, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'd be one. I'm excited, but. but <laughs> we'll do. What's that? You want to do another one? Sure. That's up to you. I mean, it's right at an hour, so I don't want to go too long for your channel. Uh, that's fine. I I don't know. I think I'll I'll probably end up playing more, especially if uh, if Caleb joins us. But uh... oh yeah, yeah, and I'll have to. Um... I'm gonna be leveling up a lot like tomorrow after work, so we can have like all the right tools, so we can really f stuff up and have a really good time. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's just nice to have an attack, you know. It makes it way more fun. Well, let's go ahead and do. Uh, let's go ahead and do one more. Okay. Sweet. I'll save. Yeah, we'll, we'll change it up a little bit. There we go. That's gonna be fun. Groovy. And did you see where to buy stuff? Uh, no. Oh. Hi. Yeah, it looks <laughs> looks like it's uh. You gotta be a certain level to unlock some stuff. Yeah. Is that a Polaroid camera? Mm-hmm. That's great. <laughs> that's what I've been rocking. That's that's fantastic. Okay. It does the job, but eh, it'd be nice if once I level up more, we'll have better stuff. Yeah. Well, it's gonna be it's gonna be all about you on that one. Oh, that's kind of cool. Okay. Yeah, I've literally mm-hmm. I've literally never played this at all, so. Yeah. Oh, you just leveled up the flashlight? Or is that always up? Uh, I just added another one. Oh, okay. Uh, eventually, we'll be able to get a strong flashlight, but I actually like to use candles, which we don't have yet, because your sanity doesn't go down when you use a candle. So <laughs> Interesting. We'll get there eventually. I mean, you can't see as well, but I don't really care. It's called, it's a, nice it's called a fire light, it looks like. Oh, really? That's what it... <laughs> it's just... That's what they call it now. Firelight. Oh. Igniter. Incense. Motion sensor. Parabolic microphone. Salt. Yeah. That's true. I should probably add. I'll add salt. That's actually cool sometimes. It's always good to add salt, especially if you're making popcorn. <laughs> Amen to that. <laughs> not, to, not, to, not to toot my horn, but toot toot. I make a dang good bowl of freaking buttered popcorn, and you're probably thinking, Solo, it's freaking popcorn. <laughs> I'm telling you, man. I, I, it's, I don't know. It's not really an art, I guess, but I do it over the, I do it over the stove top in a, in a, in a pot. You put about as much kernels that covers the bottom of the pot. And then I use like extra virgin olive oil, but but the flavorless, the the, the light the light tasting stuff, right? Mm-hmm. Just a little bit, like maybe a tablespoon, to give it a little bit of oil. And then I heat the burner up all the way before I put the pot on, so it pops it all really fast. Let the burner oh, heat up, shoot. put it on there, put it on there. Then then after it's popped, put it in a bowl, and you melt butter. And you put butter over it, and you shake it. Put more butter over it, shake it, and then salt the crap out of it. It's it's freaking amazing. 
so yeah. that's that's smart because you like you get an even layer of butter on all the plot lines not just on the top yeah it's uh i i watched i watched him do it at the movie theater once i'm like i bet you i could invert and in, invent my own little way of doing movie movie popcorn without the freaking oil and the freaking crap that they use like you know the the butter flavoring oh yeah whoa wait whoa wait whoa hey that's awesome yeah it's it's simple simple but you can't go wrong with with all natural butter and regular regular old stuff so i'm drinking tonight exactly. this strawberry kiwi zevia i remember one time i gave you one of these at work Yes. And I also gave you one called Pineapple Paradise. Mm-hmm. They don't stock them anymore at any of the stores I go to. So, oh, yeah, it's kind of a bummer. Might have to, might have to let's, let's get online and uh, yeah, you're probably hearing yeah, double of me, aren't you? <laughs> nope. Nope. Oh, you mu- I, you muted you your headphones on your on your Discord. Oh, okay. That's what I did. Gotcha. I'm gonna cool. keep I'm gonna keep mine on, I guess. Yeah, might as well. Let's see. Oh, I'll, I'll give us a crucifix this time, just in case, and then we'll head on in. Oh, baby. <laughs> there it goes. Where are we headed? I asked right as soon as he disappeared. Camp Woodwind. Camp Woodwind. I'm enjoying this so far. I suck at it, <laughs> but I'm enjoying it so far. Yes, sir. James is in here somewhere. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, it looks like it. It looks like James got kicked. Huh? I'll wait here for just a minute. I don't know, guys. We'll see if James comes back. His internet, his internet either went out or something. Let's see if he texts me. There's a text. <laughs> James said his system just crashed. Oh, James. Well, let's see if we can can we get out of here. Uh, we can. <laughs> That's funny. Welcome back. There's some jobs ready for you. That's hilarious. All right. Well, I am going to probably end my episode because we're at an hour and 15 minutes. Um, I don't know. Maybe we'll play one more. Let me know what you guys think. If you want to see me play more Phasmophobia, I, I've been enjoying this so far. James James has kind of helped me learn, learn the ropes. And uh, it's it's been fun. I mean, obviously, I suck at it still, but uh, that's been good. It's been a good experience so far. <laughs> so, I have yet to still eat this. After my October Scarefest is over... I will probably be eating this live. I will let you guys know. Right? 
gotta have gotta have some time when I have nothing else going on and uh, a couple gallons of milk to drink so I still have it I need to get rid of it I need to eat it well I'm gonna go ahead and I think I'm gonna cut the episode real fast and maybe James and I'll play some more but uh, like I said we're already at hour and hour and 16 minutes anyway yeah <laughs> so I'm going to mute those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we're going to go ahead and go to our menu. All right, let's see here. Actually, let's see here. Whoa, hey. There we go. Let's turn this down. Just so I can do my exit screen. All right. Let's do this. All right, so we're going to call this an episode just because we're in an hour and 18 minutes. I'll probably play some more with James tonight. Maybe I'll shoot another episode, but I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Phasmophobia. It was a lot of fun, uh, <laughs> me learning how to how to, how to to do this. So anyway, let me know if you want to see any more. Solo Stick signing out. See you on the next time, y'all. Keep it real.